Hello all, Havoc here. Alright, so in our last episode, Tonka and Tycho came back to soon.tm. Man, the names are good this season. Thanks guys for all your help on that. Comment down below, and if you haven't yet, go check out things over at Discord. Alright, so. We brought Tycho, who's out there on the helipad, and uh, Tonka back for resupply and I remembered the item that I was forgetting copper so I loaded up on copper wire it took a good minute but we're back filled up with ice uh, almost maxed out there's all that copper wire let's grab the last of the ice and here we go that's gonna do it for now that's a good amount of ice if that doesn't get us to fall gracefully I don't know. Falling with style. So, let's do it. Let's dock there. I need to turn the collectors off. Oh, wrong button. Collectors. Not connectors. Collectors. <sighs> There's a difference, and I am aware of that. It just doesn't seem that I am aware of that at times, though. So, all right. All right, Tonka, wiggle out of here, would you? Come on, buddy. All right. And a little more, a little more. There we go. That'll work. And lock it down. Let's go get our buddy Tycho and head on back. So, first of all, power on, dampeners on. Oh, that was a bit excessive on the acceleration part of things. So a mental note for next time if I'm building a Tyco, put the connectors in better positions. Get it that uh, I was called out by many of the viewers in the comment sections on previous episodes. But yeah, alas, I didn't think it was that big a deal. It is that big a deal. Should get it pretty close, yeah. It'd be nice if the HUD didn't cover up 100% of everything I need to do here. And... Come on. Right about... Right about there. Proximity. Make sure the tip is good, because that's been a concern. So I want to make sure his dampeners are off. Because it makes it kind of wonky when they're not. Right. Um, we're getting over here. And away we go. This is a great combination. I really like the loadout on this. So I can do a little tip action, a little thrust action. I don't like seeing large craters where my vehicles are when I fly up. You can see it just there as it's trying to render in. It's just a eh. whole lot of uncomfortableness when I do that. All right. 
Alright, so we're going to come in from back of the harvester. Actually, we're spot on, right like there. Very nice. Very nice. And oh. <laughs> in retrospect, I wish I would have made <laughs> the docking clamps in different positions. I was right the first time. There we go. Scoot forward just a touch. There we go. We're doing proximity. Kill dampeners so it doesn't fight everything. And you can just power down. You're good for now. Tyco, doing a good job. Keep doing what you're doing. Tonka, my friend. Wait, what are you guys all needing down here? Let's take a look at that before we get into the hydrogen production. Metal grids. Can we get that under production? I don't think so. No. Um, survival kit, please, maybe. Oof. That was a whole combination of wrong button presses. That's what that was. Okay, production. No, no metal grid production. All right, so I'm a dork and don't have my handy dandy notebook open, uh, also known the inter the internets, for what makes the parts tick. So let's get to it. Metal grids come from the fabricator, which means now I have to go build one of them. Which means it probably takes some metal grids as well. So let's go ahead and get back up in here. Ah, there we go. Okay. Fabricator. Hmm. It's going on top because I want to be able to access that port on the back of the assembler. Uh, about now. You hook me up, Bob? Just about. Don't need that no more as everything else is now completed. Alright, um, uh, we need some parts and some pieces. Metal grids and some copper wire, or not metal grids, electromagnets and some copper wires. Uh, some of this, I believe, is up in here. Like that. And that. Really? Did I really not put that stuff in my inventory? Oh. Or did I not put enough? That might have been a, a key part of that uh, discovery. My inventory. Yeah, I didn't put it in my inventory, because I am a dork. The first step in fixing the problem is acknowledging the problem existed in the first place. Okay. Now...
Make that 1200. Once we dock, that is. Uh, let's turn the O2 off first. I don't want to start pumping hydrogen just yet. So, control panel. O2. Upgradable, in fact. Off. And comments from last episode, I was asking whether or not Tonka is going to get squished in the process of this uh, falling gracefully. And no, uh, the goal is when we go to actually lower the harvester down, is uh, we're going to put Tonka and Tycho <laughs> up there, <laughs> just someplace off to the side, so they're, they are not squished. I'm not down with squishing my rides here. All right. So these are going to get welded it up. 250 a piece. Uh, I think I'm going to have to step that up a bit. So production fabricator. Yeah, I'm going to have to step it up. because Well, um, we're not making any. So that's a problem. So it needs cobalt, nickel, and iron inventory. Do we have any cobalt? No. Nickel. We have a smidge. We got a ton of iron. I ain't worried about the iron. I knew we had iron. So, uh, G gravel separator. Man, we're pulling a full-blown production facility over here. Power cells, metal grids. Uh, Let's get to it. Need the thing to work. We got to get the thing done. So, uh, no. And again, sandwich department can't fit in there. I can do. How do I want to get this going? Mm, yep, right there. I'm liking it. It's going to be temporary, so I'm okay with that. Oh, oh, yep, yeah, oh, I like that right there. Ocho. Place it. G. I want yield mods or speed mods? Uh, I'm going with yield mods. Okay. 20 superconductors each. That's a lot. That is not lost upon me. Okay, it might be lost upon me because I'm still doing it, right? If it wasn't lost upon me, I wouldn't be doing it in the first place. And here. Yep. And then. Here. Yep. Boom. Done. All right. Nailed it. Aced it. Can't be stopped. Uh, Bob, where are you at, buddy? Um, we have a Bob on this ride. There we go. Here he is. I need some lights in here is what I need. Some functional lights at that. Okay. Uh, so, to get all of this up and running... To, we have refineries running, right? No. No. Control panel. Yeah, none of their... We have one refinery working. That's the one on Tonka. That sucks. All right. So, with that being said, we got to get production running. To get production running, we gotta get the drill running. To get the drill running, uh, I really was expecting this to go a bit smoother this episode. Mm, I think that's where the problem went. Uh, I guess it's, it's far enough down below. It's off, right? Yeah, it's off. Okay. And okay, 
300 meters down below. Let's turn it on. All right, we got stone rolling in. Control panel, let's get to the refinery. You're on inventory. There we go. Nickel, gravel. Okay, so let's go back to the drill segment. I think we're gonna have to revisit how this is gonna work. So you stop for a minute. We need to figure out refinery we got working, right? We gotta get that gravel sifter up and running. That is the awesome sauce of this entire scenario here. You sir need a whole lot of everything. Um I don't think any of that stuff we're actually short on. That's the kind of stuff we're short on. Superconductors and, and shenanigans like that, right? So if I go like that. Uh, it said a whole bunch of things, and I don't really know what any of those were. We got superconductors, so we got what? Oh, I'm a happy individual. We just need some metal grids, that's it? Really, we have the superconductors, but not the metal grids. All right, well, I mean, there's something to be said about that, right? Um, let's get all those shenanigans put away, except for my steel plates, keep those. And so let's go yeet, yank, yoink, steel, borrow from here. Perfect, just enough. As soon as this bad boy's up and running, ah, get fine. I can work this way. Uh, power cells are next. Let's go put that hydrogen engine back together. What we can of it. Uh, power cells. I'll take a battery gladly apart to make this stuff work again. Batteries are not in this room. When you forget where you parked your Tesla wall. All right. Oh, that hurt. Almost hurt twice. Okay, so the idea for this platform was to get just the things I need to get done. I was not expecting to have to recreate the entire build process for everything. Oh, yeah. All right. It was that this moment have realized he had a lot of work left to do. Oh, so part two, this is not working out to being good at. <sighs> All right. So let's get over to here and get the refinery. This guy right here up and running. Let's get cobalt over there. So that can get refined and we can make more metal plates to make more things. So what do you need? Industrial refineries? You guys need heating elements. Oh my goodness, more shenanigans. Let's heating elements come from fabricators. Hey, buddy. Oh, that was a fall. Why didn't I just mm, check it from up there? Fabricator heating elements. So that'll get us refineries online. 
so we can actually do real deal work like so <laughs> now we're playing with power all that stone's gonna be processed like lickety split I would love to do yield bonds on all these is that gonna be a possible thing This would be a happy havoc, right? What? No. A happy havoc right here. If we can get yields on all of this stuff. I, don't, I mean, if it's a thing, it's a thing. There's a lot getting welded. Oh. I mean, look how much copper we got out of that. Just that one quick burst run, right? 114,000 gravel being produced right now, guys. That is bonkers. Oh, this is looking good. This is looking really good. <sighs> I like this part. This was part of the design to walk through here. I wanted to have the yield bots in here. Yeah, I like it. I like it a lot. To be able to get around like this, I like it. It's, uh, yeah. You guys, it's like a 50-50 split. Some are mocking my catwalk game. Some are loving the catwalk game. And it's pretty much right down the middle. And all the yield mods are done. Mm, that's exciting. Which means, uh, you, sir, your game is on. Because these guys are just going to be full tilt now. And when one's done, somebody else can work. Oh, no. Hey. Oh, they're all full tilt now. <laughs> Ooh. Burden ours. This is exciting. Why isn't that transferring from there to there? That doesn't make sense. Here. It's not even close to full, but okay. All right, so I need to go turn. Wait, hold on. Let's check one more time. Ah, mistakes were made. Stone. It's not going into containers. That's what I wanted to make sure. It is not at the moment, but. Sifter. Is about to have more gravel than I can use for a minute. Alright, so we're going to go turn the drill off. Get to burn through that gravel. Alright, all that stuff's going to get produced. We're making things. It's going to come down to just taking a minute to get through all these resources. So production, you can stop that. Oh, no, you're auto producing that. Never mind. Fabricator has made none. That's not cool. Cobalt to the fabricator, to the refinery. All right, so once it burns through pretty much everything, we'll start making progress towards the end game. So, there wants some more metal grids. 
Use up some cobalt, and there it goes. All right. Well, with that, we're going to wrap up the episode. I appreciate you guys coming out and supporting the channel. Um, you know, I keep bringing it up. Go check me out over there on Discord. Uh, shenanigans over there. Uh, lately, it's Seven Days to Die and World of Warships. And a little bit of scenario action in Space Engineers. So, good way to get a hold of me. Uh, just generally chat and try to have a good time. And thanks for being here. This is Havoc. Have fun and keep gaming.